Yeah, that was like a macho action shot. You see how I was like posing but not posing. You know what? I just had a question, just a fundamental question. What the hell is is life even about? Is life about lawyers and financial planners and 401k and trying to get to retirement, dedicating the 40 most productive years of your life to working and then hoping that you survive without some horrible fucking illness? to get to retirement age where then you still have your faculties enough to like know when to change your diaper and maybe you get out, I don't know, maybe you get to go to a sizzler buffet every now and then. Is that what life is about? I honestly don't know anymore. Or is it about the guy that I saw at the beach, 60 something years old, had tanning oil on his front. I mean, just glazed up like a donut, but yet he was only burned on his back. I couldn't figure it out. And I was like, well, maybe that's what life's about. I think I'm more confused at 54 than I was at 24, when I knew what life was about. It was about getting wild and partying, whatever. We just left a restaurant that serves fried food and I was watching people leave and walk down the stairs and all I could think about was that tanker that got stuck in the Suez Canal. This is without a doubt one of the most gorgeous nights we've had this summer. The sky is absolutely amazing, the light is incredible and uh, I'm just shooting image after image after image of like the clouds and the sunset and then I'll get back in Lightroom and uh, I'll be like, why the hell did I shoot all these pictures of clouds? What am I gonna do with these? And then I save them, I save them all. I'm not like you jackals out there who like save two JPEGs and delete the rest. No, 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 I save them. Because I'm a bookmaker. And lo and behold, these damn things will come in handy at some point. And then you'll be like, who's the jackass cloud photographer now? Okay, you see these people? See these people. And then you see these people. And then you see those people over there. So I'm using these people as my foreground. These people as my midground. And those as my background. So I'm trying to get as close as possible to these people over here. And then I can uh, basically stack up a 35 millimeter frame, give a little depth. Because this light is absolutely effing incredible and this area that you see out in front of me here this kind of where you have people that this distances from one another this distance you got people over here on the seawall you got people on the beach this is my spacing this is the kind of spacing that i wait and wait and wait and wait for and i will come back to it again and again and again some nights i make something decent other nights i suck ass I do know that life is about a good pair of shoes, or in my case, 17 pairs of good shoes. These I like. They're relatively new to me. Still breaking them in. Breaking them in with plantar fasciitis, mind you. But a good pair of shoes, especially if you're a photographer, hence the camera. If you're a photographer, you might want to have a good pair of shoes. I have many, but these are kind of nice. And remember, don't be a schnook. It's not how you feel, it's how you look.